Hey, this is Tom with NaturalDogTrainer.com, and today I've got some advice, some training advice for you you might not want to hear, but you really need to. Um, a lot of dog owners are under the misconception that a dog is just a furry little human, and that they think exactly like we do, but you're wrong. Here's why. I've been a professional, been in the professional dog training arena, and I can guarantee you that your dog does not, I'll repeat, does not think the way you do. I mean, don't get me wrong. Dogs are intelligent. They have great learning capacity, but they don't think the same way humans do. Does this mean I don't love dogs? Of course not. I've always loved dogs, always will. In fact, most of the time I'm more comfortable with, you know, dogs than humans. Here's some uh, advice on how a dog thinks. Do dogs operate on instinct. They've been with humans for so long that they instinctively read our body movements and moods. This gives the illusion that they think like, a, like us. Have you ever noticed how your dog obsesses over a ball when he wants to play? You can move the ball around, the dog's eyes are going to stay fixed on it. You can pretend to throw it, the dog heads off in the direction that you threw it. Um, if a human wanted the ball, we'd wait for you to put it down, then we'd take it. Um, see the difference? Here's how a human needs to think. Too many people believe the dog actually understands what they want immediately. They believe the dog's got to uh, adjust to the human way of thinking. When the big fact here is, if you want to train a dog to be successful at it, you need to adapt to the canine thought pr process and the way they think. They're social pack animals, and they need. Uh, we need to think the same way they do. They live in, like I said, they live in a pack, or they're pack animals. There's an alpha member of every pack. One that sets up the rules and enforces them with a little discipline. You need to become that pack leader. If you don't, you're going to find out your dog's the leader. When bored, humans can turn on the TV, turn on the radio, read a book. Uh, you name it, we can do it. Dogs don't think that way. A bored dog is going to resort to activities that we may think completely unacceptable, such as digging, chewing, and a lot of other things. If you want to keep your dog occupied, think like they do and imagine what they would do for fun. Dogs like to play, go for a walk, or, or, you know, get outside when they need some recreation. And here's the most important part of dog training. Becoming your pack leader, or your dog's pack leader, is the most important thing. Giving your dog recreation is important, but the, the structured lifestyle of a pack, and you've got to be consistent with it. Dogs are like people. They learn through repetition. You can't feed... You, you, Therefore, you can't feed the dog last one day, then feed him first the next. And this is going to utterly confuse him. He's not going to know where he belongs in the pack. Your dog needs to remember he is the bottom of the totem pole. Alpha members eat first, then beta members, then so on. The dog always eats last in a mixed human, human and canine pack. This apply, applies to dog training as well. Teach your dog sit to sit and use the commands as a precursor to everything. He wants to go out, sit. Wants food, sit. Want to be petted, sit. He needs to learn that he, it's, it's an earn your way. You got to earn everything. Um, if you really want to make your dog happy and yourself a long way, you need to forget thinking about dogs like humans. They're not humans. They're dogs. They give affection just like humans, but their thought process doesn't work the way you would think it does. You can create a healthy pack atmosphere. Um, be sure your dog knows this place in the hierarchy. Dogs eat last. They're low man on the totem pole. The first command your dog should learn is sit. And you need to have, make sure you have complete control over your dog with this command. You want him to sit no matter what he's doing when you say it. I'm Tom from the naturaldogtrainer.com. You can stop by for some video, more videos. We've got articles. We've got guides, uh, product reviews. You name it, we've got everything dog. Come on by.